Here's a painting that uh, I've been working on on and off for a long time and I'm starting to like it, which is a good sign. Just a couple of days ago, these trees were kind of solid and I've opened them up. I like that better. One of the things I'm going to do today while you're watching is to put a few highlights, highlights that are uh, snappier than what I've got here. I'm also going to darken this area, leave this piece of uh, uh, ground cover vegetation kind of in this value, but I'm going to increase the contrast on this one right here as if there's more light shining on it. And that's uh, about it. Uh, and because, and the reason I'm doing it is because uh, when I'm looking at the painting, I see these uh, two uh, 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 p these two items right here in the foreground as being so overwhelming that I'm really not concentrating on anything else. And I, the balance, uh, the balance is what I'm working on. The balance, I mean, the masses are here. I'm not going to move this over here. I'm just going to uh, try to make a balance. And the balance would be to increase the contrast here to kind of draw more attention and probably this stuff back here too, but maybe not today. So one of the things is this area is in shadow. And so I'm going to reduce uh, the highlights over here by bringing them down just a little bit. I'm using a, a Utrecht uh, um, a brush which I, I bought some time ago because I like their paints uh, and uh, and so I, I purchased uh, these brushes thinking I, I would like them as well but as a matter of fact I don't and the reason is that uh, after the first day's use uh, they're uh, useless <laughs> they just end up crumbling and the hairs the, the, the uh, brush hairs end up coming off and and making a mess so um so here i'm gonna put a little more highlight in here make this a little lighter but anyway the point is i wanted to make this darker on this side uh with just uh, a few highlights um here just so that the relationship between these two areas that are not getting a lot of sun or light are going to remain uh, kind of in balance. And then I'm going to end up increasing the contrast uh, on this piece right over here. In fact, it can go even more here, there. That was the intent, a little here. Yeah, I'm going to increase it a lot more uh, on, on one of these right here. junipers or pines that are just starting out okay and then I said I was going to brush my brush and the other thing I was going to do is put some really punchy highlights uh, into this area here uh, because from a value standpoint uh, and I my the problem, of course, is that I end up saying, ooh, that looks nice. Let me put it somewhere else. But uh, no. Here. I think that's about it. I did say, yeah, I like that better. That, that ends up punching it up just enough to, uh, to get your eye over here. And this can have a little bit of it. Yeah. Keep that in the darker area. And then I will make a, a punchier, bring this green just a little bit over here. Again, it seems to be so isolated back over here, but bringing it here is if there is a little bit of sunlight in that area will work for me. There, maybe back here. Back here is where the could be opening up there. Um, I think, again, <laughs> every time I look at this, I find my, uh, 
brush hairs everywhere and that but anyway I just kind of scrape it off when it's I just scrape it off and I and I like impasto paint but but uh, uh, I don't when the paint gets so thick that it starts casting shadows uh, it ends up kind of disturbing me as well so uh, the other thing I was going to do and I don't know if I will now but maybe try end up having a, uh, a line yeah, it ended up being almost identical and uh, and I was looking at it and saying well I could bring that up just a hair so it does look one of them is larger than another one of them ends up having a um, ends up having a highlight here so so I mean for for now uh, the only other place where I do want to punch it up a little bit is this area right here uh, I would want to bring that area I've got these nice reds in the background and so knowing that's the kind of material that's available here I'll end up bringing it into this area here just bringing it up just enough to make a difference it's I will put in a little bit of shadow area too here here there there and uh, I'm gonna put a little bit more highlight into this area here uh, let's see there A little bit more. Yeah. Some. I'm going back and forth, and I, as I'm doing this, I'm saying, mm, I really could use a little bit more contrast and a little bit more of a highlight in this area right here. And is my thinking correct? Well, the only time I'll really know is after I step back from this and decide, yeah, that's fine, or no, it needs to be increased. I'm going to put some more shadow areas in here. look at this for a while let me decide yeah I've improved it or no I'm gonna have to take out my scraper and uh, remove some of the things that I've done yeah again the relationship between these two is now if this were as bright as this one here or the highlights were the value were as as uh, as light as this one here i don't think it would work i want that one darker it's kind of in a shady area uh-huh and i could use a little bit of a darkening in areas here too so and i do like some of the highlights that i've been put in there just to not have it totally disappear I did like I do like what I did here by bringing some of the highlights that are here closer to this area, but not any further than that. Um, you know, I mean, I'm looking at this, and I can I can uh, work on individual pieces, but the more I'm doing, uh, not always, but the more I try to improve on something that I've got, the better I seem to be liking it, and that's really. There. I wonder if uh, yeah yeah there I also think that this whole area of trees can be improved, but I'm going to look at this for a while. 
Anyway, I hope that was something that was of use to you and uh, kind of get a feeling for my thinking. And uh, if that is the case, then it's been a successful couple of minutes. Yeah. All right. Thanks, everybody.